Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of The Valder Beebe Show, a new kind of spiritual talk show. Broadcast on FM radio, internet websites, and print publications. I am well known for that celebrity interview. Interviews that we conduct in studio, by telephone, and by satellite with today's most fascinating people. I'm Valder Beebe, and I'll see you on ValderBeebeShow.com. Carolyn O'Neill, thank you so much for joining me live here in Dallas, Texas on the Valder BB Show. You are welcome, and I love Dallas. My son went to school there. It's a very good, great place. Of course, the weather's perfect. What can I say about that? Yeah. Let me ask you. All right, then. Well, we're in Dallas, and we need easy weeknight meals also. What do you have for us? Well, you know, as a registered dietitian, I certainly am all about good nutrition, but I'm also about, like, reality and what families can actually do. And my recommendation is... Why not, at least a couple of nights a week, use your freezer as your own personal chef? Now, I'm working with the good people at Stouffer's on their Balance Your Plate nutrition campaign. And what all that's all about is enjoying family favorites, such as lasagna. And Stouffer's, of course, makes a very famous and very delicious uh, Stouffer's lasagna with meat and sauce. Um, but to balance that plate, of course, there's 18 grams of protein in a serving, only 300 calories, all the things the dietitian likes. But to make it even better, I say balance your plate with fruits and vegetables. And you know, Valder, since it's the fall, I say why not go in your supermarket or maybe the farmer's market for those beautiful fresh apples. And rather than putting them in a bowl on the kitchen counter where they might get ignored, cut them up and put them in a salad. I have a farmer's market fall salad with golden raisins and green apples and red apples and a sweet and spicy dressing. I know you like spicy in Texas. Has a little bit of yeah. hot sauce in there and a little bit of honey, lemon juice, and of course a little vinegar and oil to make a vinaigrette. So again, you're balancing your plate and you have a beautiful piece of lasagna with a gorgeous salad. You don't have to make a boring salad. You can really jazz them up. Well, I want my audience to know, Carolyn, that you're an award-winning di registered dietitian. You're a speaker, an author, and a food travel journalist. You're also into food, nutrition, agriculture, travel, and a healthy lifestyle. We love what you, you know. <laughs> well, I'm a healthy foodie. That's what they call me, I guess. And actually, I wrote a book. It's called The Slim Down South Cookbook with Southern Living, and it is healthy Southern cooking. I know, I know, but of course, it's definitely, definitely possible in the South, you know, we, we love our farmers, and we certainly love the vegetables they grow. One of the neat things we need to talk about farmers and ingredients, uh, Stouffer's has also made another change. Don't worry, the lasagna is just as delicious. But the ingredients list actually reads now more like a recipe. It'll say vine-ripened tomatoes, freshly made pasta, mozzarella cheese. So again, when you're looking at that ingredients list, you see all these things that you recognize. And of course, the lasagna is freshly made, and then just simply frozen. And so, again, your freezer on that busy night when you don't have time to make lasagna from scratch, you can have that in the oven while you're helping the kids with their homework, or maybe somebody's rushing off to some practice, a music practice, a dance practice, who knows what, and you've got a, a lovely dinner uh, for your family, and, guess, and also time to talk to them. Maybe you want to find out what happened at school that day. Yes, I just finished talking to someone about the importance of sitting down to a meal with your family. I mean, it's, it, 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 I, we can't stress that enough. Well, I think, you know, that with um, Stouffer's Balance Your Plate nutrition campaign, it's not just about the food. It certainly is about, as you mentioned, that experience of sitting at the table, enjoying the beautiful colors of food, the flavors of food, discussing that with kids, and knowing that frozen entrees, such as the Stouffer's lasagna with meat and sauce, is delivering good nutrition, and then again, balancing that plate. Oh, another idea, uh, speaking of the freezer, uh, if you have a bag of frozen peas in your freezer, who doesn't? Put it in a food processor. You like hummus? The kids seem to love hummus. Um, I use um, green peas, and you can see them right here. Put them in the food processor with a little bit of salt and pepper, olive oil, lemon juice, and you have this beautiful emerald green 
hummus that the kids and certainly mom and dad or a grandma, whoever, anybody in the family can enjoy with sliced cucumbers or whole grain uh, chips or something like that while the lasagna is cooking. So you're getting another serving of vegetables. And we all know that Americans are maybe not doing that great of a job in getting all the fruits and vegetables and whole grains that we need in our diet. So again, an easy way to rely on your freezer as a personal chef to help you put delicious, colorful, nutritious, and tasty meals on the table, even on a busy weeknight. I like that. Now, you said we can put uh, those green peas out there. Can we put those edamames? Can yes, we so that's put... a super good idea. I would use the same recipe. You would, edamames have a little bit more fat to them because it's a soybean. Uh, you know, soybean oil comes from soybeans. So put those in your food processor, I would say, with the lemon juice, or a little bit of garlic maybe, and uh, some salt and pepper. You're good to go, and you can make your own edamame hummus. That might be fun, you know, for the kids to press the buttons on the blender or the food processor, you know, and then they <laughs> see, they can see how foods, oh, and edamame, uh, you can also find them, you know, in the freezer section, to see how foods, uh, I don't know, I, I think the freezer is kind of like nature's pause button, if you will, and, uh, and, I'm, and again, with the peas, I'm not talking about the ones in the cheese sauce, I'm talking about just the plain ones, again, as a great, um, you know, resource, essentially, for you to throw something very quick and very simple, and of course, good for you too. Well, Carolyn, I love dietitians at this point in my life because you guys have been talking to us for years, and I think you've finally broken through to us. So wow, you're 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 high on my list. You really are, and so my audience. If, if there's a place online, can they go and get some more of this kind of advice? Because this is great. Oh well, thank you. Yeah, there is a, a great place to go. It's so easy. It's nestle.com backslash balance. You know, I was talking about balance today. And you can find out a lot more about like recipes and information on how to balance your plate. And again, it's not just about, of course, balancing good health and nutrition. You're balancing your life by uh, really, again, using your freezer as your personal chef and having that extra time to talk to your family. And you know what? Relax a little. Enjoy yourself. Toss a salad. Dinner's ready. I'm inspired. I'm really, and I'm going to make the edamame. Thank you so much, Carolyn. Please come back. Oh, I'd love to. Okay, have a great day. It's my joy. You have a great day, too.